I'm Carla Martin and my role is a Products Guidance and Insights Manager and that basically looks after all the sensory program here for Uncle Toby's. The degree I'm studying at Charles Sturt University is a Bachelor of Health Science, Food and Nutrition and I graduate at the end of this year. CPW is a worldwide organisation. We sell cereal everywhere in the world apart from America and Canada. So we've got a major centre in Switzerland in a place called Orb. We also have a, a large centre inside General Mills in Minneapolis. So we have lots of meetings and movement to and from both Switzerland and America. I've been working for Uncle Toby's for about the past 20 years and I started on the, the factory floor making muesli bars and then I was able to get a position for consumer services and then I was lucky enough to get a position here at R&D which was fantastic and that was in the sensory area and I worked in and out of that role for a little bit, had children, came back and then I was lucky enough to get another role in the sensory program and that led on to me uh, wanting to do the degree and that just gives me more opportunities in this area as well. CSU is our closest food school university which is great because it's in the country so we have a relationship in terms of employing some of the students over Christmas breaks we're helping to sponsor our PhD project at the moment and we've got a great relationship with the, with the academics there. We could phone up and ask them questions. I really needed that flexibility and I found the lecturers at Charles Sturt just fabulous. They seem to really understand those that aren't full-time students that also have another life outside of the university and need to juggle a lot of things. The program really tailors to that. Some of the tests that I do here is descriptive profile, so looking at the differences between products. We do a Tetra test, so are the products the same? We do blind tastings as well with our descriptive panel. It's to take away the appearance. And then we do some shelf life testing, how old are the products, how long are they going to last. We have products down in our different conditions, temperate, Mediterranean, tropical, arid, and we bring them up each month, test them against our control, how are they doing, are they going rancid, are they going soft in texture. The Uncle Toby's panellists, we, we really couldn't do the job without those guys here. We've had CSU students come and work in our pilot plant, which is brilliant for our relationship with them and for the students to see what's really going on in, in the world. Part of the degree involved attending some residential schools at Wagga and I did attend some practicals at the National Life Sciences Hub. There was some food technology, some nutrition, there was also microbiology, some physiology. So it all related back to what I was doing here, but it also let me, uh, if I wanted to move into a laboratory position or a, uh, wanted to go on and do dietetics, I could. I can move into product development. So it's a really broad range where I can move to if I wish to. My message to anyone considering studying a degree in food and nutrition, particularly with Charles Sturt University, is go for it. I would recommend it to anyone in a heartbeat.